Let's stick with politics right now. Just a day after Governor Abbott signed those sweeping new gun laws into place, police departments around Southeast Texas are thinking through how they will impact officers. Texas has seven new gun related laws. The one that's attracted the most attention allows permitless carry for Texans who are 21 and older. So it also eliminates a training requirement. 12 News reporter Dominique Laid talked to a firearms instructor and a police sergeant for their perspective on what comes next. Leaders at the Nederland Police Department. It really just removed the permit requirement. Are all already preparing for the state's new gun laws to take effect. As long as you're still legally able to possess a firearm. You don't have to have the license to carry. Sergeant Cody Corcoran says the bill still includes safeguards. Anytime you purchase a firearm, you're going to have to go, go through a background check. Um, if you have the, the LTC license, license to carry, um, you know, that makes the process easier. License to carry instructor Josh Dempsey with Red Lion Tactics is focused on helping people understand the new law. You have to sit down and you actually have to go through every law step by step, the same that the police officers do in the academy, the same that we do in the license to carry courses. The new bill being passed, licensed instructors encourage you to get proper training. It's a good idea to seek out that training. It's still a good idea to get certified. Um, on the caliber and the weapon and the gun that you're going to want to carry to protect yourself, protect others. Officers in the state's larger cities made no secret about their opposition to the bill. Gun owners have a duty to ensure that their firearms are handled safely and a duty to know applicable laws. The licensing process is the best way to ensure this message is conveyed. Back at Nederland PD, Sergeant Corcoran doesn't think a lot will change for him or his fellow officers. A concealed carry to a license to carry, now it's just a constitutional carry. Your law-abiding citizens are going to carry, you know, the right way and do the right thing. Dominique Lay, 12 News.